start my days off early, and it's the same every day. I read my Bible, pray, move my body in VR. Here's me going off on some targets. Then shower and get ready for work. Today I seem to have forgotten how to put on eyeliner and that's me struggling to make them look even. I didn't have time to do my hair this morning so I just blow dried it. All before I have to sit down and start work. So I start work or at least I try to start at 8 a.m. And until lunchtime, this is where I'm at, where you can find me. Just like that, it's lunchtime and I'm on my way out to run a quick errand for my grandma so I can hustle my way back as soon as possible to have some time to eat. This week, I'm trying to finish my bagels and cream cheese. So for lunch, for the remainder of the week, is gonna be eggs with a bagel, cream cheese, and smoked salmon. I was too lazy to bring out a pan, so I just used my waffle maker. And let me tell you, this is clutch. I know I can be unkind, but you're not always understanding. I like to take my time, but time is what you're always chasing. While eating, I called my grandma to tell her I did the errand for her and enjoyed the rest of my break. Before I sit at my desk, I always have to have a cold brew coffee to keep me focused and energized for the remainder of the day. I make a concentrate and as you can see, I put a little bit more than I usually do because I needed that extra kick today. Mondays, right? And then I filled up my water bottle to start work once again. What I do after work varies day to day, but I try to do some personal admin and planning before I eat dinner. If dinner is not made already, then I usually just cook, but since I had something to eat, I decided to plan out my week. This Friday, I happen to have a company off day and plan to go on a solo date to the beach. Also, my parents wanted to take a quick visit to my grandparents' house this weekend, so I also planned what I was going to pack for the weekend.
For dinner, I had a leftover shrimp upo that I made last week. And I'm having that with rice, a slice of spam, and kimchi. It's real simple, but it was so good and filling. While eating, I watch some YouTube videos or episodes on Netflix just to take my mind off of what happened that day. And that was me almost forgetting to pray before I eat. But God caught me. I was feeling really uneasy today, so I decided to have some chamomile tea to calm my nerves and help me sleep. And just like that, it's Tuesday, where I repeat the same things. Getting better at my eyeliner. At least, I think so. And sit down to work. I decided to make something different for lunch. I was getting tired of the bagel and lox, so I'm going to whisk up these eggs to make it into a roll of some sort with rice and my leftover spam. I realized after doing this that it was the wrong kind of pan to use and I burnt this side but all good I fixed it we made it work trying to make it look real cute by rolling it but well it was all right I did my best
took me way longer than I expected and by this time I only had like 15 minutes to eat this but it was all good it was delicious and spicy which I love here I'm making a sparkling water with some aloe juice that's flavored with mango and it's so good like so good And of course, you gotta document your food before you eat it, especially if it looks pretty. Um, and I scarf it all down before I have to sit, sit down and work again. My desk is so small that I have to really think about what I put on my desk and so I ordered this laptop tray that attaches to a monitor arm so that my laptop is not on my desk. I'm the type of person who needs to have my desk and my house clutter free and all organized so I'm, this is my attempt to try to do that for my small desk space. Don't mind the wires that's gonna all disappear soon. I just have to figure out how to arrange my laptops for work. It's getting there, but it's not 100% there yet. I'm a creature of habit, so dinner was the same as before. I was running late today, woke up late, but still did the same things and got to work on time. However, this time I didn't put on any makeup or blow dry my hair and that's alright. I was back to business as usual for lunch, nothing special here. And after work, I had to do some errands and decided to go to my favorite place, Raisin Cane's, because I did not want to cook and I wasn't going to be home anyway. So this was a lifesaver. I was able to eat this for two nights in a row by splitting this meal in half. Genius, I know. Oh, so good. My mouth is watering. I missed my workout this morning and before lunch I stretched and just moved my body so I can get some blood flowing, listening to some music, because this is my Friday. So I put away some dishes before I prepare my lunch and just groove to the music. I had the same lunch but put it into a sandwich because I was pulled into a meeting that rolled into another meeting and I ended up eating my lunch at my desk. It's all good. I was happy that it was my Friday and I had the day off the next day.
finally the day is over and I get to spend the rest of my night just relaxing. For dinner, I reheated my leftovers from yesterday. And using an air fryer to reheat Raisin Cane's is probably the best thing ever because it's like you just bought it. And I opened up a Truly because I truly needed it since one of my meetings ran a little long. You gotta treat yourself every once in a while. It's Friday, so I plan to go to the beach. I wake up early so I can make my lunch that I'm going to pack with me. And for today's lunch, it's going to be a tuna mayo roll with cucumber. Oh, 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 oh. I took a break from working out in VR and walked the length of the beach before I sit out in the sun and enjoy my picnic. Saturday and I woke up super early so we can drive 
all the way to my grandparents' house. Can you guess where it's at? We spent the day just eating and laughing because we're leaving the next day. Thank you.